One of today's graduates, you see who you see here, may not have made it without the help of the community. His name is Kenneth Canales. WSLS 10's Jenna Zipton talked to the once dropout student about how his life has changed just this year. September is really bad. Looking at this calendar and all the days marked in red, you can see a student struggling. Every red square is a school day missed. I drop out several times and then I try to get back in. Kenneth Canales was living on his own at 17 because of what he says was a bad family situation. He was working three jobs, had trouble paying bills, and was staying at friends' houses. School counselors at William Fleming High School could see he was struggling and connected him with United Way. The school brought us Kenneth as a special case and said that we had a young man who was uh, greatly in need of services and that he was falling into a gap. The Rehousing Youth for Success and Education program, RISE, filled the gap. We had a family that offered to actually accept Kenneth into their home and give him a loving, stable, um, kind of a host family type of situation and so that has given Kenneth a lot of support that he needs in order to be a student and finish his schooling out in the context that most kids get to succeed in school which is in the context of a family. Before Rice uh, I didn't have a life like I was all, always working I didn't enjoy my life. Now he has people who care and after making up many classes is graduating this year. Kenneth, it's like a feeling that I never feel before. It's really awesome. Now I can like focus on my study. And I think we've really, in Kenneth's case, changed the trajectory of his life. You know, he could have ended up homeless at 18. Um, he could have ended up dropping out and not having a diploma. He is headed to Virginia Western in the fall and interested in engineering, a future he never thought was possible until now. Jenna Zimpton, WSLS 10.